Trevor Zegers has been unleashed since coming back from injury 10 games ago. He took three games to warm up, even though he did look like the best player on the ice in those three games, but he didn't get a point. Since then, though, he has seven points in his last seven games. The Ducks are just completely different with Zegers in the lineup. He is just so creative and keeps his head up. He is able to make passes that don't make sense. He maintains the puck so well, and he is starting to become a two-way player. He is feisty on the forecheck and is able to anticipate passes. It's truly becoming an understatement of how important Z is to this team. He brings energy and swagger we have been missing most of the year. And now that he is fully healthy, he is showing off his shot too with this ripper versus the Kings. He comes off the bench, Zellweger pulls a defender to himself and dishes to Z flying down on left wing and Zegers rips it past Riddick's left shoulder, similar to his goal last game versus the Kings. I just can't wait to see what he does at the World Championships. He may be becoming underrated at this point because of how much hate he gets. Thank you, I appreciate that. You're welcome, Z. A much better game from the Ducks than versus the Flames. They played a pretty even first period. Just high energy and we're just having a lot of fun, so it's good. Just too bad our knowing friend, Mr. Penalty, would come out to play again in the second, and the Kings would score on the power play as that $8.5 million man, fourth liner. I guess he was actually playing top line minutes in this one because Kopentar was resting, but quick passes and it would bounce to ball for an open net. The Kings would get another one midway through as Dossel was screened by traffic worse than the five freeway, and Roy gets one. 2-0 heading into the third. Then we would get that Z snipe I mentioned earlier, and the Ducks were buzzing after that. Close on so many chances, but Riddick played well, and the Kings would get the heartbreaker with two minutes left. Lewis shoots in close, and it goes to Fiala, who wraps it around. Ducks lose 3-1, to one, so opposite score from the last freeway game or whatever, yeah. Leo, you kill me. He was killing it in this game too. Once he learns to compose himself and finish some of these chances he creates, it's over. He absolutely destroys Dowdy here. Would have been so nasty. He does stuff like this at least once per game. I can't wait to see what an NHL offseason in Florida does for him. Another big help might be a new line mate coming his way in Cutter Gautier. It could, and most likely will, be as early as Thursday at 7 p.m. in Vegas. I fully expect Cutter to be signed today or tomorrow. Cutter's team lost in the championship game. He showed up, but no one else really did. His coach overcoached, and now Cutter is in some hot water because of some confident pregame comments he made. The real question is who will become more hated, Cutter or Z next year? Going to be a heck of a competition for years to come. I do plan on live streaming Cutter's first practice on the 15th or the 16th. Maybe both. We'll see. If you enjoyed the video, like and subscribe. Thank you for watching and go Ducks! Leo and Cutter in perfect sync. The chemistry.